Hello, my name is Kay Montano and I'm doing a masterclass today behind the scenes of the June issue of Herod's magazine. And I'm going to start with um, Chanel Le Beige here. I'm going to use this to bronze and contour her face. So I'm going to start by blending it onto the cheekbone and just below. I do this on both sides and make sure it's very even using a lovely round soft brush. What I'm doing here is I'm making it darker just here underneath Anna's cheekbone and on her cheekbone and along, along the edge of her face, really making the most of her contours. I think the mistake a lot of people make with bronzing is that they put one colour flat all over and that's not really what you want because that looks very unnatural and you don't really want a flat look to your face. So next I'm going to use this lovely palette here called Seduction. I'm going to create a lovely big smoky brown eye. So first of all I'm going to use the pale one here. I'm going to use this colour here on Anna's lid, like so. I'm going to use a brown here. I need to darken all along the edge of the lash line here. I'm really creating depth in here. This is the darkest area here, just next to the lashes in the outer corner. I'll do the same thing on the other side. And I'm going to use this colour to slightly create a bit more dimension. As you can see, it's all about blending. That's how you get that lovely soft smoky look. So now that we've finished the eyeshadow, I'm going to put some black mascara on. And I think I'm just going to put black mascara on the top lashes. So I think this makes the eye into a more beautiful shape, I think. So now that the eyes and the cheeks and the whole face is done, all we've got left now is a lipstick. Now these are the beautiful, beautiful, gorgeous Rouge Coco Shine lipsticks from Chanel. And I'm going to try both of them on and see what they look like. So I'm going to try the fair one on now, which is called Interlude. This gives it a more sort of vintage, sort of almost 60s feel. The pale lips with the dark eyes. And then if you wanted a more contemporary look, you could mix in Pygmalion. The, the whole idea is, using very neutral tones mixed with colours that really pop. I think that's what makes this look very modern. And that concludes our masterclass for June.